Charlie. I got a shot. Oh my god, how did I survive that? Hello, what's going on guys? It's Charlie, and today you're watching a triple chem strike on freefall. Um, yeah, the chem strikes are pretty slow in this gameplay. Uh, I haven't played this map, like, properly in support teams. I'll play it every now and then, say if I was, like, in a free man or something, play it. Probably not ever get the end, which is why I've probably never seen the gameplay, I'm not sure. But, here it is. A triple cam on a free fall, and I hope you enjoy it. I know it's with the honey badger again, but I don't know. I've never played this oh map. Oh my god, get properly, off the floor! So I thought try it. Give it a go. So, it's not that bad. So, I don't know. That's there in the background. Today I actually want to talk about, like, how I started pub stomping. Because I thought... Like, you all know that I pub stomp, but you don't know why I pub stomp. Or how I got into it in the first place. So, we're going to talk about that. First of all, in Black Ops 1, I started out as a sniper. I actually used to be one of those little... Faggots running around sniping, quick scoping, back flipping, and shit like that. Obviously, that did, that, I only done that for our Black Ops 1. <coughs> um, sorry, still got this cough. And then, uh, that's pretty much all I did in Black Ops 1 was just snipe, and occasionally I'd use a machine gun. And, that, and then I, was, I had a new account, because my I can't remember, I think I got hacked from my other one. So I got another account, and then I had like a 3.5 or something on that, just like no sniping. And even when I did snipe, I'd still keep my KD going, so it's all good. And then, MW3 is when I started, because uh, oh in the beginning of MW3 I was a little randy, I had no idea what I was doing. Set up my classes oh, and wow. stuff. And then um, my brother actually ended up getting a Moab, and I was like, oh wow, that's pretty good. And then I decided I wanted to get one. So I was proper grinding for it, I was going for it, going for it, going for it. Eventually got one, and then uh, he was saying, oh, I'll come so close to getting a double. I was like, oh, that means yeah, I'm going to have to try and get a double. So I tried to get a double, got it. And then the more I was playing, like consistently for like, going for my abs and stuff, the better I was getting. I noticed my KD go from like a 1.2 up to a, a 2. And it was, like, pretty quick as well, because the amount of I was going for these gameplays and stuff. And I reached 20th prestige, reset my stats, and then I met a few people who I started playing with. My KD was like 2.7, and then uh, I was just getting better. Double my abs were pretty consistent, quite easily to get. And I ended up getting reset. I, I oh think I got reset, I can't remember. Reset again, and I'm like a 4.30 on the game, but I don't really care. And then that happened, so I eventually got loads of mobs on there, and that was pretty good and pretty swag. And then Black Ops 2 came out, which I didn't play very often at the start of the game. I generally thought it was the worst game I've ever played in my life, so I didn't play it that much. And then throughout the game, or throughout MW3, I decided, oh, we might as well, I'm going to go try and play Black Ops 2. So I got my friends on there, we played multi-team for a bit, and I ended up realising that, oh wow, this game's actually not as bad as I thought, dropping double nuclears and stuff like that. So that was pretty good. And then, um, while I was playing multi-team, I got noticed by a clan who was like the number one elite clan. And they picked me up, I ended up playing with them all the time. Then I got so much better playing with them, I had like a, a 3kd when I joined. I reset got like a 5.7 and then the game done a retarded glitch and then I got to like a 6.7 or something now, I think anyway. That's that's pretty much what I did. I used to, and then while I was playing that, honestly all I was doing was double nuclears, everything. It's pretty much the same thing throughout the whole of the game, but it is what it is. And then Ghost come out and this is when I said during Black Ops 2 that I'm just gonna proper just play in support teams throughout most of this just because that's like... <coughs> sorry. That's just the way that... I had, uh, in MW3 I barely played in support teams, but when I did, it was so much more fun, you can have so much more fun playing and get better gameplays, stuff like that, that's why I was thinking, during Ghost, if I actually play support, I might be pretty good, considering how much better I've gotten since I started Pop Stomping in the first place. So, we tried doing that in Blitz for some reason, because I didn't think Domination was any good, because I didn't know the spawn traps, I didn't know anything, and then Amp picked me up, because I can't remember... I don't know, but that was good. I'm on like a 20. Amp picked me up because I've always wanted to join oh, just, a good clan, and I joined Amp, and then um, they got shut down, unfortunately. So we started Vault, and that's where we are now. And that's, this is when I started proper going support because they was like, "Oh, we need to up our standards now." And uh, I was like, "Fine, this is this is obviously not good for me because I mean I've got to try harder and play more." But then again, it ends up bringing the better out of me because I now I'm pretty goddamn good in support. No, it sounds cocky, but that's true. Um, so yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoyed my little uh, pub something story there. This gameplay is coming to an end. I'll probably leave you with like 20 seconds of a song just for the YOLO reason swag. And I'll catch you in the next video. See you later. I'll try. I'll try. I can't do con. I've got care package. Tiger told it in.
Charlie, have you got a triple or a double? Friendly chem strike incoming. 